right, so I've been doing some thinking here about, uh, we've had quite a few very uh, strong freezes here lately. And the nurseries here locally, and a lot of people uh, recommend you using frost cloth, frost blankets. Cover your plants. Alert, alert, danger, danger, it's going to freeze. Well, I've tried just about every gimmick there is out there. Yes, I call it a gimmick because pretty much most of this has not worked for us. And that got me thinking of, uh, about frost cloth. So let's think about it. I've used uh, burlap. I've seen people recommend to me burlap, which I would highly not recommend. That doesn't work at all. Uh, these uh, frost cloths, they call them. You can get them in rolls, packages. They can cut them at the local nursery for you. I've used these uh, tunnels here. Um, they worked somewhat okay, but not as well as I was like. We used these uh, hot caps the other couple of weeks ago not really working for us either so let me got me thinking we should be asking ourselves is not about frost cloth but how much protection does this frost cloth provide how much so it's called frost cloth obviously not freeze cloth frost cloth okay so what the question most of us should be asking is how much protection does this blanket, this cloth, provide us if it's going to get uh, 30 degrees, 28 degrees, 20 degrees, whatever it may be, how, much, how many degrees of protection does this frost cloth provide us? And that is, I think, the key of why this may not be working for our garden here uh, locally. Um, a lot of the products actually do not um, tell you how much prote protection they provide. So let me go inside and show you what I found here on the uh, internet here on my computer. All right, we're inside here where it's nice and warm. It's quite cold out there today. Um, I went on this website here. This is uh, Agriculture Solutions. Um, and I happened to find this uh, company here. I'm not sure if they make this product or not, but they have frost cloth that is rated Temperature rated. Okay, let me get in here a little bit closer. This is by DeWitt. Okay, if you look here, it says a deluxe half ounce frost blanket offers four degrees of frost protection. And then if you look here, it's got a deluxe, offers four to six degrees of protection. And come all the way down, we have the ultimate thermal blanket, three ounces up to 10 degrees of frost protection above outside temperatures. So there's several different uh, frost cloths that are actually available and rated based on what maybe you need here for your particular application depending on the outside. Of course, I would just highly recommend for, for us at least because I like to plant as early as possible and sometimes we have crazy temperatures like this winter, you know, I'd probably get the most protection possible. And of course, the more the protection, the higher the cost. So, you know, there's quite a bit of uh, different options. This company here sells it by the roll. Um, as you can see, 300 feet rolls, depending on the certain widths, as long as 500, 12 by 250, etc. And you can notice the prices go up as the um, protection goes up. Okay, so now I just went and searched just for their ultimate blanket here. And they have three options here available, it looks like. And as you can see, these prices are, well, it's quite pricey, I would say, for covering up our plants. So now you have to decide if you want to invest in protection or if you want to wait to plant your plants a little bit later it's just a give and take there i did find on ebay some people were actually selling it by by the foot so you could just buy it by the foot obviously they bought a roll of this and are selling it by the foot on ebay i'm not sure what the price is 
versus buying a whole roll. So there's my thoughts on the uh, frost blankets, frost protection. Just think about it, uh, you know, it makes sense to know how much protection these frost blankets provide. You know, there's obviously gonna be a varying differences. The other day when we got down to 18, 15 degrees, um, that ultimate blanket that provided 10 degrees of protection was, would have still not been enough. So, you know, there's just something to think about as far as protecting your plants with these frost cloths, frost blankets, whatever you want to call them. Think about what is the temperature rating on the blanket? How much protection is provided with the particular frost cloth that you may have or may be using? Even the poly tunnels, etc. How much protection do they provide? So uh, thanks for watching. Maybe that'll give you some ideas to think about. Um, maybe you've experienced some uh, issues with covering your plants like I have. So uh, leave your comments down below. Maybe you have some suggestions or, or ideas that I haven't thought about. Of course, uh, there's a lot of opinions on protecting your plants from the freezes and frost. So uh, hopefully this will give you some uh, insight and thoughts about what I've been thinking about, about protecting our garden in these uh, freak ice storms that we've been having the past couple of months here in North Texas. Keep warm, everybody. Happy gardening, and have a great day.